Good afternoon, everybody. This is Dustin Fader off the book of Red Twilight, coming at you again with another Let's Play Zombie U. Okay, last time I was playing, um, I believe I had I just uh, picked up something. I think I just oh yeah, I just picked up the key card. So now it's time to go outside and fight my first horde of zombies, I guess. Okay, so I was just watching through some of my earlier Let's Plays, and I came to the shocking realization that I basically have three jokes I just repeat time and time again. Uh, you've probably noticed based on the position of my camera that I am back to my old setup, or new setup. Today we trust the future. How much will you make tomorrow? Do these actually exist? Do they have these spinning signs somewhere in the world? Probably. I don't know. Unfortunately, I've done a lot of traveling, but the majority of it has been through uh, the central United States. So you ask me questions about the rest of the world, and I have to scratch my head and say, mm -hmm. So yeah, I've told about three jokes that I've been running through time and time again in my old Let's Play, so I'm going to try not to do any of the old jokes again. Instead, I'm going to see if I can come up with all new jokes. Which, granted, isn't very likely, but I'll try it anyway. This smart map thing is actually really cool. It's a really neat idea that you'd have, and if something that would. Huh, ammo. Something like this that would act as kind of a uh, way of searching your environment, and it creates a hell of a lot of light, too. I completely forgot that I was supposed to be doing commentary on the game. Chips. Wait, what did I just pick up? Okay, I guess I just picked up a gun. It is kind of wonky the way that this uh, map basically requires you to be looking away from the ca away from your camera, which is not a particularly good idea in my opinion. But, look at this loading screen! This is beautiful! This reminds me of the movie 28 Days Later, in case you've ever seen that. I'm sure you have. It's one of the better uh, Outbreak movies. Talking about Outbreaks, I was talking to the, about something like this with uh, my friend Nako from Twilight Nako Studios, in case you've been watching my other videos. And, um... Oh, leaderboard statuses. All made of people who are a lot better than me, I have to imagine. I'll get that for you. Some... 
people have their, you know, zombie U diplomas. What? Nothing? Oh, okay. If you say so. Cause there's a zombie walking around below me, that's kind of interesting. I have to imagine it's going to be coming this big mess of... Scan every CCTV junction box you locate so I can hack it and bring those cameras back online. Is it becoming a mess of me just scanning everything in sight? Taking a few steps and then doing it again. Out of range. Hi. You're not doing anything. I just wanted to scan something over here and it said that there was something there. Oh, suitcase. I don't know what this is. Uh, I guess it's yogurt? Oh, it was a bird that I scanned. Alright, that makes sense. Yes, because birds are food, I guess. Actually, that doesn't make perfect sense that birds would be food. What I'd want to question though is, is it good food? Are birds full of delicious? Probably. Okay, so this is my first time stepping outside of the bunker. Let's see what sort of insanity awaits me out here. Let's creep right out here because I don't need that. Or. Maybe I do. Picked up another soda can. Um... I can see a monster there, why can't I scan it? You just walked past a working junction box, by the way. That's a camera hub, in case you've never noticed one before. Whoa, 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 are you sure you're ready to face down a bloody horde? It's your life. I see your point. I will not go that way. It is you. Uh, C4. Okay. That's cool. Throwing flares. Now they could come in handy. Bright lights to distract the dimwits. Okay, this is what the shooting mechanic in this game looks like. Maybe I don't need to bonk my way into victory in the end. I'll just stick a couple... Okay. Oh, that's distracting. Alright. Okay, that time I just missed. Forget it. 
I'm gonna bonk him. I'm gonna bonk him. Uh oh. There. Bonked. How long we into this video? Ten minutes. Well, this is going better than last time, I must say. The idea that I'm doing this on my own cam, on my own camera, not on my roommate's camera, is making it a little bit easy. Hello. Oh, that's outside. Whatever it is. That's that's you. I already scanned you. What the hell? Whatever. I guess I was telling you my current objective. So much stuff to scan. Hey, that just says rubbish bin. Flare. Oh, eh. Birds. Okay. That goes down. I go down. Honestly, this isn't that much different than playing it on normal mode. Not that I clearly remember what normal mode looked like or anything. It is obnoxious and also that there's so much interactable stuff that's nothing. But I guess that's sort of what the world would look like, isn't it? And if we were walking around in a world where people had gone mad and started nomming all over each other, probably wouldn't be a lot of useful stuff laying around in the end. Although it kind of depends on how you perceive the word useful. Hmm, I guess I don't do that. Guess an alternate path to this area if I wanted it. Anything useful? Have I been over here already? I see no evidence of it. Downstairs. I'm seriously walking around digging inside garbage cans for what? Food? Ammo? Those are both useful things, I guess. Ooh, I'll use the alternate way in. Ha 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 ha. Wait, what? What the hell? Oh god. What do I do? What the hell is this? Um. Hmm. Somebody called God. Something's gone terribly wrong. Um. I broke the game. I've been playing for an hour, and I, I broke the game. This is not about the most fuckness you've ever s I am inside the wall. My... 
My roommate tells me that he doesn't believe me when I say that things break in my presence constantly. Look at this. This is proof of it. When I'm around, things break. Whee! Okay, I can't even do that anymore. Whee! I, I kid you not, I cannot move. Okay, um, maybe I'll restart next week? This is Dustin Fair, Author Book Red Twilight, signing off. Have a good day. <laughs> I broke it.